y'all for the ones who faithfully been watching, but the ones who been watching ain't subscribing. I see y'all. Go ahead and subscribe them. You gonna come back anyway, so and it's free. Ain't like I'm taking money out your pocket. Just taking a little time, but ain't like I'm taking money out your pocket. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. What you waiting on? Why? Why not subscribe? And it's free, and you gonna come back anyway. I'm just saying, common sense. Let's use it. <laughs> This is gonna be kind of like what a little weekend vlog, I guess. I'm trying to stay consistent and 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 actually put my full effort and time and motivation and sweat and blood and tears into this YouTube thing because I wanted to make it work. And every time I do that with anything I do in life, I, I always make it work just as much as trucking. Trucking, boy, I put my sweat, tears, and blood into this thing when I wanted to get uh, my CDLs, and I made it work to the point to where I only had to take the CDL test one time, and I passed. But anyway, if you're new, welcome. If you're not, if you're a returning subscriber, hey, girl, or hey, boy, hey. Um, I am Kimberly, hence the name of the vlog. I am Kimberly P. But yeah, like I said, it's gonna be a weekend vlog. Today is Friday. It is Friday, Friday, Friday. Um, we are currently in, where we at? Iowa, Cheriton, Iowa. We have to go pick up a load in um, Desmond's, Iowa, and then take it to Austin, Miss, uh, Minnesota, which all that'll be done today because it's like, from where I pick up from, I think it's like two or 300 miles. So we're gonna, we got an empty trailer because we dropped here yesterday. <clears throat> yesterday what happened was thursday um got live loaded went to a truck stop took a shower um yesterday morning and um got on the road to come drop this drove nine hours to get here and to drop this load off dropped this load off yesterday around about five o'clock uh and then took a 10 hour break hooked up to the empty trailer um yesterday as well so now we're about to drive um i think it's like an hour and 15 minutes to this washout because this trailer has to get washed out it's blood and stuff all in the back of this so we're gonna get this trailer washed out we also have to get a second load lock i only got one load lock on the back of my trailer i think i'm gonna get out and look in these um other her spot trailers to see if they got some load locks in there and get out and look in the back of these other trailers to see if there's a load lock in the back of them if it is i'm just gonna jack that then we're gonna go pick up the load which is probably like four or five miles away from where i'm getting a washout from and it's a live load so once we get loaded there we're gonna be headed to minnesota austin minnesota to drop this load off and get live unloaded and then our next load we pick up is in um st james minnesota and after we pick that up we're gonna be taking that to um greenfield indiana which is due there by sunday but yeah like i said yeah i'm gonna put my shoes on start my clock get out look at the other trailers there also give me some sun real quick and stretch and um get myself ready to get on this road but yeah i was just checking in um y'all see i switched back to my glasses um what was it yesterday yeah it was yesterday my right contact ended up ripping in my eye so i woke up had to take that out and i took the left one out too as well so i was like Shh. i'm just gonna let my eyes rest and wear my glasses um i bought these glasses well these frames from what about these from they're ray-ban frames i bought these from um because I get my eye exams at Walmart. Yeah, I got these from Walmart. So I got the Ray-Ban frames from Walmart and they just put my prescription in them or whatever. You know how they do. I got a second pair of uh, glasses as well. They name brand, but they're not name brand to the point to where it's like known. But um, I think these are like three, maybe four hundred dollars. I bought these, not last year, but the year before last, I ended up buying these. But I bought a second pair too that's not name brand when I bought these. It is. All right, y'all, so we found one with a load lock. So I'm not, I don't know what paper it is, but I'm about to snatch this load lock and put it in the back of my truck. I should have grabbed this goddamn trailer. This trailer clean, but it is what it is. I have to get the one they tell me to get because they put it in the system.
think so. Flying. You got our two low locks. I had to go through not the first trailer that I checked, but the second trailer. I'm gonna see where the heat comes from. Where I turned on heat? It sounds cold for some reason. It's chilly outside actually. Um the second trailer I checked had a uh, extra low light. It was actually cleaner than this trailer. I could should have hooked up that bitch and took it, but this place once they tell you they assign you a they assign you a trailer to grab so they can keep it logged in the system how many trailers they got to buy. So I gotta keep the one I got. I'm passing by the wash house anyway, so it really don't make no difference, just take time. But yeah, so we got our second low lot, so we don't have to go in the store for that, but we are gonna pull in a few while and um fill this trailer up. I might go ahead and fill up everything because by the time I get there I'll be at a half a tank. So I'm gonna go ahead and fill everything up. Well not everything because I don't need no death. So I'm just gonna put fuel in the truck and then put fuel in the reefer and then go inside and grab me something to eat for today. But yeah, I'm rambling. So let me finish getting myself situated. We're gonna hop on this road and I'll probably beat y'all once we get to the truck stop or freaking um the washout. Let me see how my hair looks because I can't see. I looked in the mirror, but you know, I don't know what these glasses, but it's like you only can see certain stuff in the darn mirror back. Don't oh, child. Anyway, I'll talk to y'all later. Okay, y'all. So, uh, we made it to the darn um, truck stop. I got fuel and all that stuff already. I got me a couple of blueberries. Um, a cup of potato wedges. He must have picked the smallest, the cup with the smallest amount in there. And um, two veggie salads. You you got to pick where you going at because you ain't gonna get to go too far. A cup of blueberry salad. I mean salad. <laughs> a cup of blueberry um things or whatever. And these look like this one got a building going on it. Let me rinse these off. But anyway, we in the washout line as y'all can see. Or whatever we gotta wait to get this trailer washed out so i'm gonna sit here and get this trailer washed out and i'll be back with y'all once i probably get to the darn place that got mildew on it i'll be back y'all We about to try to get into this. I don't like coming to places like but They try my goddamn G stuff with this. Mm.
tell y'all, we made it to this place, but let me go ahead and check in because this this will be the last time I go to this place and the next place. Up there is forgot during box trucks. Back here is not forgot during box trucks. It's really not. Out here. Anyway, y'all, so I checked in to this place, and this place looks like it on this side. Only box trucks come to. I'm gonna show y'all what it looked like. I'm trying to get this fly out. Get your ass out. Okay, y'all, so we at this place, Lineage, Lineage Logistics. Um, we got loaded already because I already felt them back there. This place, you, I just back in. I don't have to open up my doors. They open the doors from the inside. It's a cold storage place. Um, but I'm just waiting for them to call me and tell me my paperwork ready before I go ready to walk in there. Uh, we are 602 miles away from the place that we're delivering to. We don't have to deliver to the first. That's I just called my company to see if it's a drop or I get live unloaded. But um, we used to be able to drop at the place that I'm going to. But I guess somebody fucked that up no longer drop that no more um so i gotta get live unloaded and today is saturday so uh, i'm trying to see how i'm gonna plan my day um i still got i still got eight hours and 49 minutes of driving left today so i might go ahead tomorrow sunday sunday i like my days to be more chill so i might just go ahead and um there go that fucking fly i need i swear how can i stand flies i need to get that bitch out of here before i move Hold on real quick. Yep, tried to let you go free. She didn't want to go free. You want to be an asshole, so I had to kill you. Can't stand when the fly get in my truck. Anyway, let me roll this other window up before.